so personally, um, using social media professionally has been really helpful in terms of just bouncing a lot of ideas off other people. There are a lot of people in, in higher education and marketing and communications that are they're on Twitter, they're on Facebook, and it's a great way to exchange ideas. You can always kind of you know, say, hey, I'm working on uh, a marketing plan for homecoming geared towards students. What do you do at your institution? And it's a great way of interacting with different people. And then you see them inevitably at conferences. And it's a great way of taking a kind of virtual social media connection and putting a, a real personal one to it, a human to human face to face one, which then kind of builds up relationships, professional ones, so that these are people, your peers, who you can really uh, connect with all throughout the year and not just a few different times or in a very closed type of way that email is. So that's always great. You know, it's a really helpful way of keeping an eye on what people are doing and keeping up to speed professionally. Um, in addition, a lot of times people are sharing what they do in the kind of non-social media side of it. They'll say, okay, you know, we just built this great website or here's a picture, they'll post it via TwitPic or something like that uh, on you know a new ad that they did in their alumni magazine. And things like that always just spur ideas. So, you know, you make the connections with the people, whether it's at a conference or whether it's on social media before you even go to the conference. And then that is just like a great, it's a great source of ideas for me and thoughts and just to kind of see what other folks are doing. And we do that all the time. Everybody in this office, whenever it comes down to planning a program or an event, one of the things that we always do is we want to see what other folks are doing. And it used to just be, all right, let's just go to their website, let's make, give them a call. and all the time now, you know, it's let's go to their website, let's give them a call, let's see what they're doing on social media, inevitably. I mean, it's it's become really one of the, the main avenues of connecting with alumni, so we have to see what other folks are doing as well. So, how social media helps me keep up with my job? Um, there's a lot of different ways, and, and some of it is simply just organizational. I mean, it allows me to see what other people are doing in my industry on a day-to-day -day basis, and, and that's great. I mean, it's helpful. It helps me kind of keep on, uh, I guess, the cutting edge, you could say. Um, the other way it helps me kind of do my job is it allows me to organize things well. Um, you know, I can always, one of the things that I do is if I'm reading something and I uh, am moving from a device to a device or different things like that, a lot of times I'll use Twitter to kind of send stuff to myself in a way. Uh, and using Facebook to connect with different folks is always really important, I think, because then it allows you to kind of uh, make a real human connection other than just reading articles and things posted online. 